Vincent de Charleston, Holly Valance, and Artem Chigvinsev. Okay, right, Len. Well, it was a Charleston with a sort of a modern <coughs> twist. And, and to be honest with you, when the music started, I thought, I'm not going to like this. But as it went along, I grew to enjoy it very much. You've got that lovely Charleston swivels going, which I think are great. It could have been here and there a tad slicker, you know, coming into some of those little twists you did. I would like it slightly more slick, but overall, very entertaining. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Thank you. Thank you. All right, Alicia. It was a modern take on a Charleston, and I loved it. I thought the beginning section was cool, DJ Valance. I thought that was brilliant. And I have to say, you're all exhausted at this stage <laughs> of the competition. It's a real fight to get to the end, and you fought your way throughout that dance. And I want to commend you for stepping out of your comfort zone, because I know that's yeah. not a style we're used to seeing you in, so good for you. Thank you. Very good. Well, listen, I have to praise you, really, for taking risks, because it's really... You, sometimes you have to push the boundary to open people's mind, and I love the, the contemporary interpretation of this dance. I've never seen something like this before. He had a little bit of swing in it, he has a contemporary, he has some street, the old concept of the scratching. I mean, I thought it was... The concept was brilliant, the execution was excellent. OK, there was a few moments of hesitation here and there, because it's very hard mixing all these elements, but I thought... The idea was excellent. It's great to see people trying new things. Yeah. <laughs> well, I guess I've got to thank you, Artem, for taking these humongous risks, because if you didn't, then we'd all be living in the 50s. Yeah. You know, and I think it's wonderful. I love the idea of a swung Charleston. I think it was brilliant. Was it danced well? Sort of. Did I love the idea? Absolutely. It's sort of, for me, like Vegemite, I'm afraid. You either love it or hate it. And I sort of love Vegemite, so well done. You loved, you loved it? Go on! Go on, then. Off you go. Be proud. Off you go. Mind. You conquered the modern Charleston Holly. Do you think you might just make it through? I wouldn't say I conquered it, but I didn't die at the end. No! <laughs> you gave it a damn good shot. It was the hardest dance I think I've ever done in my life. I, I, I bet it was. It was very, very complicated, very ambitious, but brilliant. Yeah, it was a lot of fun. I loved that we got to do something modern, and because um, I wasn't like thinking I could ever do the Charleston. So <laughs> you got out your comfort zone and you went for it. Congrats to you, Artem. <laughs> Who is that? Scores are in. It's time to get the scores from the judges. Craig Revelhorde. Eight. Len Goodman. Eight. Alicia Dixon. Come on, nine. Yeah. Bruno Tonio. Nine. Yeah. 34 out of 40. They felt the fear and they did it anyway. <laughs> right down this 
number 09015 222006 and call when lines open later if you think Holly deserves a place to dance in next week's grand final. You want a shot at it, Holly? I'd like to have a go. She wants to have a go. One more semi-final routine to go and this promises to be a cracker.